Hi, and thank you for visiting my channel. For more information, kindly subscribe and follow. Now let's get started. Former WWE manager Jim Cornette recently praised Rhea Ripley despite not winning the Women's World Championship at Bad Blood. Cornette complimented Ripley, as well as Morgan for their match despite the botched finish involving Raquel Rodriguez. Ripley challenged Morgan to a match wherein Dominic Mysterio was inside a shark cage and suspended near the entrance ramp. Mommy was close to winning the match before Rodriguez returned and attacked her, causing a disqualification. It was supposed to be a different finish, but there were miscues at the end. Nevertheless, Cornette liked what he saw from both Ripley and Morgan. The longtime wrestling veteran even described Ripley as the best women's wrestler in the world and said that she is even better than some male superstars. Rhea Ripley is not only the best woman wrestler in the business, she's better than half the men. And I must admit that Liv Morgan in this instance, the match made sense. Liv was aggressive cause she's so much smaller. She was sneaky, she worked the bad leg that they have established that Rhea has had problems with, so I liked the match and it wasn't the typical girl wrestling of these days, Cornette said. 45 colon 40 46 colon 13 Rhea Ripley was named by Pro Wrestling Illustrated as the number one women's wrestler in the world last year. Ripley has a chance to top the list again this year despite losing to Liv Morgan at WWE SummerSlam. Rhea Ripley reportedly signs a new contract with WWE. It's no secret that Rhea Ripley is one of the most popular WWE superstars in the world today. Ripley has turned into a legitimate top star, not just in the women's division, but in the entire company. According to PW Insider, H slash T Sports Illustrated, WWE has rewarded Ripley with a new lucrative five-year contract extension. The terms of the deal were not released, but she reportedly received a well-deserved raise. In addition to Ripley, the company is also looking to secure the futures of current women's champions Nia Jax and Liv Morgan. Both stars have taken their game to the next level this year, not just in the ring, but also in their overall body of work. In the chaotic world of professional wrestling, opinions can be as polarized as the fan bases themselves. The recent WWE Bad Blood event had fans buzzing not only for the action in the ring, but also for the unexpected praise that Rhea Ripley received from a notoriously critical figure, Jim Cornette. Known for his outspoken views, Cornette's approval was a surprise to many, marking a significant moment in Ripley's career and the perception of women's wrestling as a whole. The Aftermath of WWE Bad Blood The evening had been electric. Rhea Ripley defended her championship title against Liv Morgan in a match that showcased the intensity and skill of both competitors. Their rivalry had been brewing for months, fueled by personal vendettas and a desire for supremacy in the women's division. As the bell rang, the audience was on the edge of their seats, fully invested in the outcome. Ripley's victory was hard fought. She had taken Morgan to her limits, demonstrating not only her physical prowess, but also her mental toughness. Each strike, each submission hold, told a story of determination. Fans erupted in cheers as Ripley stood tall, the championship belt gleaming in her grasp, but little did she know the real battle for recognition was just beginning. The Jim Cornette Factor Jim Cornette a name synonymous with wrestling history, had been vocal about the evolving landscape of professional wrestling. His critiques often cut through the noise, focusing on what he believed were the essentials of wrestling, storytelling, character development, and in-ring prowess. Rhea's Reaction For Rhea Ripley, the acknowledgement from Cornette was both validating and surreal. She had faced her share of critics over the years, particularly in a sport often dominated by male voices. After the event, she took a moment backstage, still buzzing from her match, to reflect on Cornette's words. Honestly, I didn't expect that, Ripley admitted in an interview shortly after the event. Jim has always been a tough critic, so hearing him say that means a lot. I've worked really hard to get to this point, and to have someone like him recognize my efforts is just, wow. Ripley understood the significance of Cornette's endorsement. It wasn't just a pat on the back. It was an acknowledgement of the hard work and dedication that female wrestlers poured into their craft. 
It represented a shift in the narrative around women's wrestling, one where talent and storytelling were recognized regardless of gender. The Shift in Wrestling Dynamics The praise from Cornette sparked discussions about the evolving dynamics in wrestling. Many fans noted that Rhea Ripley was emblematic of a new era, where female wrestlers weren't just seen as supplemental characters but as main event players. Her matches transcended traditional gender roles, showcasing that wrestling is wrestling, regardless of gender. In the days following Bad Blood, Ripley found herself at the center of conversations about the future of women's wrestling. Prominent wrestlers, commentators, and fans began to discuss the potential for more female-led storylines and main event matches. The narrative that women could carry a show became a tangible reality, and Ripley was leading the charge. Rhea's Future, The Road Ahead With Cornette's endorsement, Rhea Ripley's path forward became even more exciting. Rumors circulated about her potential feuds with top-tier female talent like Asuka and Charlotte Flair, which could further elevate her status in the wrestling world. However, the stakes were also higher. She now carried the weight of expectations that came with such a claim. As she prepared for her next appearances, Ripley embraced the challenge. If my matches can inspire more women to get into wrestling, then I'm doing my job, she stated, her determination evident. The goal was clear, to prove that women's wrestling could be as compelling and captivating as any match on the card. Cornette's Impact on the Industry Jim Cornette's influence cannot be overstated. His critiques have shaped the careers of many wrestlers, and his praise could lead to a shift in how wrestling promotions view and promote female talent. His acknowledgement of Ripley might encourage other commentators and promoters to elevate women's wrestling in their programming, leading to richer storylines and more substantial character development. The ripple effect of Cornette's words extended beyond just Ripley. It was a call to action for wrestling organizations to invest in their women's divisions, ensuring they had the platform to shine. Fans began to demand more from promotions, advocating for equal treatment and opportunities for female wrestlers. Conclusion, A New Dawn for Women's Wrestling As WWE Bad Blood faded into the annals of wrestling history, Rhea Ripley emerged as a beacon of hope and change. The unexpected praise from Jim Cornette was more than just an acknowledgement of her talent. It was a signal that the landscape of professional wrestling was evolving. With voices like Cornette recognizing the quality and depth of women's wrestling, Ripley stood at the forefront of a movement. In the weeks and months to come, as Ripley defended her title and continued to push the boundaries of her craft, 